Sunday, Monday, happy days. Tuesday, Wednesday, happy days. Thursday, Friday, happy days. The weekend comes, my cycle hums. Ready to race to you. These days are all happy days. These days are all share them with me. Goodbye, gray sky, hello blue. There's nothing can hold me when I hold you. So right, you can't be wrong. Rocking and rolling all week long. Sunday, Monday, happy days. Tuesday, Wednesday, happy days. Thursday, Friday, happy days. Saturday, what a day. Grooving all week with you. Well, I know that you recognize the theme song. One of the most iconic television shows of all times. It's Happy Days. And one of the stars of that show who has gotten into the singing business is on the MPW Digital TV Celebrity Hotline right now. Let me grab him. It's Don Most, who you remember as Ralph Malf from Happy Days. Hello, sir. Don Most, how are you? Whatever. Vintage Sound, hello. Hey, it's Michael from Envision. I'm hey. sorry I'm late. Uh, you have till what's 32, so here's Don Most. Here okay, thank you, sir. Don, you're on with Tony in Davenport. Don Most! Hey, Tony, how are you? Man, I'm so good. I'm excited to talk to you, and uh, welcome to the great state of Iowa via telephone, of course. Yeah. I mean, it's... Yeah, thank you. It's one, it's one way to get you here, but I would love to see you uh, come to town because uh, I think that this is great. So you have a record, and it's holiday tunes, and the timing couldn't be better. I mean, I can't believe it, it, I, that it's the second in November already. Yeah, I know. It's and 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 having the Christmas thing out, it seems a little early, but that's how they do it, you know. <laughs> um, but I have a, as you know, a single, uh, Stacy Bone, which is a, a song that is from my. Uh, main CD that comes out in February. That's called Mostly Swinging. Mm-hmm. Uh, but but uh, th- we decided to do some Christmas songs as well. And um, and and the record company, you know, it do- it doesn't come out. Uh, the hard copy doesn't come out till December ninth. Mm-hmm. But they but they put it out digitally yesterday. Um, you know, iTunes, Amazon. So it seems to me like well, isn't it a little early? But um, I guess in 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 that field. Uh, you have to get it out early, so uh, so there it is. Uh, uh, Donnie was swinging down the chimney tonight. <laughs> I love the title. Like, was the was the the title of the record your choice, or was it collaborative, or what? It was actually my wife's idea. Huh. Um, she's very creative, and uh, and she uh, there's a song on one of the songs I do is uh, Santa Baby, mm-hmm. and and one of the lyrics in there is you know hurry down the chimney tonight. So um, and since I'm doing a lot, uh, there's an emphasis in, in, on some on swing. Uh, my other album is is mainly swing or sure. mostly swing. And, right, right. <laughs> um, so so there is some swing. Not not all the tunes are swing, but but some are. So and since that's what I've been doing a lot of, uh, she came up with this uh, swinging down the chimney night, and I immediately loved it. And uh, when I mentioned it to the record label, they really liked it too. So. Um, so that's how that came about. You gotta gotta listen to the wife, you know. Oh, I know. Trust me, my my wife is the smartest person I know, and uh, <laughs> <That's right. laughs> she's always right. And uh, that's exactly right. What else can I say that'll make me seem like I'm a good husband? Ah, uh, she's <laughs> she's beautiful. You know how it goes, Don. We gotta we gotta listen yep. to them. They're they you're they doing great. Well, you're I tell you great. what, it seems like that your wife and my wife, you know, we both. Certainly, I'm not trying to say that we have similar careers, but we both have unique jobs that require time, you know, having been out of the house or on the road. Mm-hmm. So it's so important having that support system, isn't it? Oh, my God. Uh, I, yeah, without that, I, I I shudder to think where I'd be. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I, I'd be uh, adrift. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah, same here. Same here. I, you know, I, I, have a, I have a four-year-old and a soon-to-be two-year-old. And they're great kids, uh, but I, I'm I'm so busy, and I'm fortunate, and work you know work hard to have gotten where I am. But man, without my wife, I don't you know, like like you said, I don't know what I would do. I would uh, yeah, I'd probably yeah. go stir crazy, you know. Yeah, and uh, yeah, they could be such a you know grounding and stabilizing force. Uh, yes, 
which uh, we need big time. Absolutely, a hundred percent. So with the so obviously you love the swing tunes, and I'm looking at uh, the track listing for uh, Demos, mostly swinging, and uh, they're all great looking records. I, I do want to stay on the Christmas theme for a second. So when you were when you were picking the songs, Don, that you wanted. Uh, to do were there ones that you've sang for a while or are any of these songs were they new to you were you intimidated by them or what Uh uh-huh good good question um i I started talking to my producer willie murillo uh you know we started just listing songs that uh either you know i really liked uh, that i thought would be fun and 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 the ones that he liked and we, and then we just started narrowing it down. And now mm-hmm. I'd never really sang any of them. Um, the, the one exception, you know, singing at, along to the record mm-hmm. or the radio uh, was one of my favorites. Was the Christmas song that made famous by Nat King Cole, you know, Chestnuts Roasting. And um, mm-hmm. so that was one that I probably sang to, you know, multiple times uh, along with Nat. Sure, um, but but I'd never sang it in, in my live show or any or anywhere, and uh, the other tunes, um, you know, there was one I had never even heard, but I loved uh, when my producer sent me some 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 examples of it. It's called "Man with the Bag," and mm-hmm. it's and it's a jazz big band jazz kind of swing uh, approach to to the song, and and I loved it, and, and I don't know why I'd never heard it. I was like, oh, we got to do this. <laughs> um, and it was a little intimidating because it was a little tricky kind of song to sing, but uh, but it, uh, it's fun. It, it came out great. And then um, it, it was his idea to do the other two, which was um, uh, it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Which I I said, oh yeah, no, that would be uh, that would be a really good tune. And he started, you know, uh, singing for me and play the approach that he had, and mm-hmm. and I, I it felt really good. Uh, so I said, yeah, let's do that. And then Santa Baby. He had the idea to do it as a duet, and um, and I had done the duet on the on the main album with uh, a, a wonderful singer Becky Martin, and that's my single that's out now. Stacey Moan is a duet with Becky, and and he said let's do it, let's do Santa Baby as a duet with Becky, and and I thought hey, and he and he came up with a really interesting musical concept, and um, where it's back and forth between the guy and the girl and 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 it's a different style of music for the guy than it is for the girl and it's really cool so um so that's how that came about and uh, and and i had a wonderful time doing them uh just it was a just joy sheer pleasure i love that that concept of the back and forth uh on santa baby because that's that's a song that people have heard kind of one way um right you know for their entire life or covered by different artists or whatever so that that'll be that'll be nice to hear um and you and i want to say that you got a nice plug uh from an old friend uh ron was on with uh mark Marin doing his podcast and he and he plugged that you got a record coming out and that you've been doing some singing and it seems like uh ron howard and i've had the pleasure of talking to henry uh winkler he might be the nicest guy ever, Don. So, um, just for the Happy Day fans out there that are listening, uh, you stay in touch with some of these guys. Do you see them that often? Is it a phone call? Is it a text, or what? Uh, well, yeah. I mean, uh, first of all, Anson and I we live about twenty minutes away from each other. Nice. And we, <laughs> and we talk to each other several times a week and see each other, you know, almost once a week or mm-hmm. close to it. Uh, you know, we're as good friends as not tighter than we ever were which is wonderful um ron's it's a little tougher he's you know he's all over the planet and uh so we stay in touch more through email sure um, but we do stay in touch and i'll see him you know when he comes to la one you know every once in a while his schedule will allow it um henry um we we spoke not that long ago and and we actually got to get for lunch a few times and um and did something anson and henry and i did uh, a show together where the three of us uh, performed, uh, you know, uh, sort of looking back at uh, the show and, and Anson and I doing the music from the show of the 50s and, and stories about about uh, happy days and clips. Sure. So that was a lot of fun uh, getting together and doing that. So, um, yeah, yeah and, I, and I just spoke to Mary and Ross uh, <laughs> yesterday, you know, wow. she called me and and we, we, we get on the phone with each other and, and just stay in touch. So it's great. It's, I, 
It's so good to hear that because that's kind of the perception that we've all had. And um, and I know that we're running out of time, but I just want to say, Don Most, uh, I appreciate your time swinging down the chimney tonight. And then, of course, we're looking forward to D Most, uh, mostly swinging, very busy with the records. And it seems like they're going to be well received by your fans. And I encourage you to keep doing this. And I'm so thankful uh, for your time this morning. And uh, I wish you nothing but success. Oh, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. You're Thanks welcome, Doc. Yeah, take care, sir. We'll talk to you soon. You too. Bye. Bye-bye.